Hey, what's up? It's Josh. Uh, haven't even shaved or showered yet, which is why I have the hat on and a little scruffy, but I'm shooting this quick uh, follow-up video for you uh, to the one I sent yesterday about uh, building free lead capture pages that convert like crazy. And in there, I mentioned about setting up redirects or forwarding on domains, and I had a couple people ask me how to do that, so I figured I'd show how to do it. Now, I use GoDaddy for my domain registrar, okay? So the, where I'm gonna show uh, to, to do this is in there, uh, but you can do it, you know, with whatever you have your domains registered. So in GoDaddy, we log in, uh, we, we find the domains here, and we hit launch. And uh, incidentally, I'm going to click on this link. I, I showed an example, or I talked about in this uh, video. If you haven't watched it yet, there'll be a link below this, probably back to this one. Uh, but I show how I made this capture page that looks like this, right? Um, so I'm going to need this because we're going to set up a domain forward for that. And uh, let's go to. Uh, I'm going to use one that. Um, I don't know if I've set up a forwarding for that one or not. Okay, so I haven't. So you pick your domain, right? You choose the domain that you want to forward, and you have two options. You can forward the, the primary domain, or you can set up a subdomain forward. And I'm going to show you how to do both, right? So the first way is you just forward the the, the just the, the regular domain, right? So you click on, uh, if you in case I you know was talking over this, you for, right here under forwarding, Domain off, manage. We're going to add forwarding, okay? And then you would paste in your link. We just have to lop off the HTTPS, okay? Go there. And then the redirect type, permanent and temporary. I honestly, I can't tell the difference between the two or what it means, but I do know that the temporary, when you choose temporary, generally speaking, it the, the redirect, the forwarding takes, uh, uh, it happens faster, because it can take an hour to up to a day for this to, to take effect. Uh, but if you do temporary, it seems to work faster. And then the last thing is forward settings. So you could forward only, which means if someone goes to, well, this is an example here. Uh, the example here that I did is a forward only. So what happens is if I copy and paste this into another browser, when I, when I click it, it forwards only. Now, forward with masking, what would happen there is that uh, it would it would keep that URL that URL this this URL here would stay that way even after I hit enter okay and if you choose forward with masking then you have to give it a title and a description and keywords either way is fine uh, I I usually use forward with masking but for here uh, we're not going to do it we won't even bother now I'm going to cancel out because I want to be able to show you how to do subdomain everything is exactly the same for a subdomain forwarding, okay, which actually this is an example of subdomain forwarding, secretformulagr.joshshanley.net, right? So, uh, you know, I don't know, secret, secret.joshshanley.org, and then the same thing, you would paste in, oh, in this case, I've got the wrong thing there, but uh, you would paste in your, your capture page link, right? You would paste in your capture page link. it to the HTTPS, choose permanent or temporary, and then forward with masking or forward only, okay? Pretty simple, right? Pretty simple. Uh, if you're checking this out on, on, uh, on our primary website, there will be some additional resources to the right, which I would encourage you to check out. If you haven't watched this video here, the, the link to that will probably be below. Uh, you should check that out and you should create or get your free uh, trial account with GetResponse so that you can do these things so you can start building your email list which is your number one asset in any business is your email list so you can start doing that uh, effectively so that uh, you know you can uh, create that asset that will uh, give you predictable reliable and scalable profits right so thanks for checking out this video check out the other sources and resources on the site and uh, back tomorrow with more good stuff like this